and you know, I have heard people complain, which is legitimate, that dollar is 1,700, you know, it could have been worse, it could have been 17,000, that uh, fuel is uh, 1,000, it could have been worse, it could have been three or 4,000 per liter, if these reforms had not been in place and has checked the escalating hyperinflation in which we entered into the into you know after voluntary removal administration it is it is wholesomely unfair right and i'm almost almost tempted to say wicked for anybody to to judge this administration after 18 months just assume that you bring a new person and he wins there's no agreement he will make with you he will not spend another eight years so you know, you just extended the lifespan of the rotation to the south by another four years. So why don't we, what has Bola Tunumbu done? Let's, let's, let's come to terms. With okay, so it's fine enough now at least. I am, I'm a bit relieved. I'm not getting to realize that a lot of the defense, a lot of the persons out there defending Bola Tunumbu's administration they are not doing it based on the gains of the administration or the solutions to the problem of this country that the administration is um, providing. It is about the northern and southern, uh, southern protectorate um, or, or uh, amalgamation that was done in 1914 that seems to have given edge to the north over the south for a long while. It is about the um, seemingly uh, protection of the superiority uh, of the Yoruba race over other race, or maybe in the south, and then the contestation of the fact that the north um, or northerners are not as more superior than the Yorubas. That is it. Of course, remember that the 2023 election was slaughtered on the on the altar of ethnicism. People that election was already lost by um allowing ethnic jigois to to sell a different narratives at a point nigerians had looking at look back at uh NSAS 2020 nigerians knew that there was need for us to have looked away from the current um, um players of the game and then everybody accepted that there was need and then the division was there in between the new parties the new entrant shore the adc guy peter Abbey and a couple of other guys but then the um, Jigoist around the Yoruba nation began to sell a narrative to saying that at the end of the day, allowing Peter to become president may, may so, somehow raise his hand over um, the Yoruba race and raise the ego uh, and all of that. So I, at the end of the day, that's what you are seeing now with doing the people in the studio. And I just pity this guy to think to think that I had thought he, he had sense with all due respect to him. Because it was, it was doing that spoke for President Jonathan. And like I've always said, um, it was Bwari that made Jonathan look good. It wasn't that Jonathan was an excellent um, president. But people like doing were also doing what Bayo and these guys are doing now. Uh, blasting everybody that cares to listen. They will not listen and then they were all um, um, dragging and blasting and all that. In short, that was some of the things that sank the Jonathan's government. Because he allowed people like doing Okupe to speak and close their ears against public criticism. So the point where the people were saying a few persons were sabotaging your government, actually Northerners and like Daisy and Imadi okay, and a few of all these guys are doing wouldn't and now doing once at all costs. He started. Every other person, right on a couple of these guys are doing blah blah on social media. They are trying to just set narrative. They have to defend their cause. Reno could visit Nigeria. Um, could, that he couldn't do for the eight years of uh, Buhari's government right now, so all those benefits. Um, Daniel is now speaking, but doing is in the office of preparing for 2027, and his own job is to destabilize the conversation that anybody um, should replace Tinubu and say they should allow Tinubu to do his way. So he's not discussing it based on solutions to problems, based on articulate. Uh, 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 ground or the fact that you could see tangible realities that you can feel it is palpable to feeling that government is working it's his own is a bioethnic uh, propaganda and it's all fine i don't have a problem at least it makes it even look better for me and i can rest meanwhile please go follow up uh 1616 on social media if you do if you're a talent you're looking for a talent manager your um, you want entertainment um, company you want event company you have an event you you need a, an event manager 1616 is the 
um, place to, to trust. Go trust these guys enough. They've done it so much. They've headed down in Benin, Lagos, and Abuja. They could help you hold your own. Whatever you do, what you want to do around the talent, entertainment, media, and events, get CC60. All kind of events. And there are all kinds of talent, all kind of entertainment at, at task. CC60 will be my guy, trustfully. And then if you, if you do business with them, trust me, you should not be scared. You will be very fine. Integrity is um, a key word with them. However, follow me on YouTube and I'll catch you another time. Bye for now.